Hey guys, it's me again. Coming to tell you about some great news. Um, there's something I got, I did successfully to my computer. Right now I'm booting it up. My Pentium 2 system from 1998. I got some great news to tell you. I've got the graphics card to run. I installed the drivers in the ornament. Running pretty great so far now. Now it displays more color. I got it to look good and all. And yes, it's running Windows 2000 now. And when I first installed 2000, I know it didn't have the on build support. So now. Got a little flash drive, I just plugged it in, copied the drivers, I got the drivers installed, and had to download them off the internet. So I went ahead and get on the internet and I got the graphic card drivers for the S3 Savage 2000. And I've been receiving a lot of help. I didn't have no burnt CDs or nothing. So I had a little USB flash drive. It's a little memory stick. You notice it's going successfully booting up. And it does run great now because it has 128 megabytes of RAM when I first had it. Now this computer doesn't give me a hard time, so I'm going to go ahead and. Put in my password and all. Watch how this thing runs. So far, when I put Windows 2000, it just runs like a charm. Yeah, I put a bigger resolution. So you can see it. Even though it has a... 4 gigabyte hard drive fits pretty good with Windows 2000 and for basic needs and it gets the job done I got some drivers installed and there's all the programs you see the only thing it does not have is an ethernet modem I transfer all the files on a flash drive and I format it with NTFS and I enable Windows Classic for and I have headphones hooked up and that's why it, you may not, there's no speak, I don't have any speakers for this computer so there's my 128 megabytes of RAM service pack 4 and it's been having good performance when I for a while and it does run great one person told me if it one if I'm going to put 98 second edition with plus 98 well, I didn't feel like putting it back because that's going to be too long of an installation. And that does take long to install 90. But 2000 didn't take long on here. And it runs pretty stable and all. It's more NT based. I still do like 98. But most, most of the time you don't have on built support for your graphics card. But I finally got the right drivers. You can see it displaying perfect colors. I got more colors now. I got 256 true high color, true color, and a higher resolution. There's my gr drive, my graphics card. And displays everything so nice. Mm.
Yeah, I changed it to Windows Classic to give it a little Windows 98 feel. To give it a Windows 98 feel, you just go to the one that says Windows Classic. Don't go to the one with standard if you want the Windows 2000 feel, if you're comfortable with it. But if you want something better than that, if you like the Windows 98 feel like me, then I suggest you can use that. And that does look good like that. But it looks better with Windows 2000 though. I'll put it back. Alright, get done shooting the video. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.